What's up guys, it's your girl Vanessa Mujica here for San Diego Sports Leader, the Mighty 1090, and we are here in Hollywood for ESPN Magazine's sixth annual body issue. Now if you're not familiar with the magazine, they actually feature athletes pretty much naked, so I'm hitting the red carpet to get the behind the scenes stories on what happened before that show. What was your initial reaction when you found out you were going to be posing practically naked? Oh man, uh, you know, I was pretty uh, dumbfounded. I was like, what? Me? What? Have they seen my body? So when the opportunity came about, I was super excited and like honored to be a part of it. I think it's so empowering and inspiring what they're doing with showcasing the true athleticism and beauty of the body. What went on behind the scenes? Give me a little bit of detail. But there was a point where, you know, I stopped taking the robe. I was like, I don't need the robe. I'm just here hanging out here, just hanging out naked. Letting you it comfortable? <laughs> Literally? <laughs> Literally. Uh, uh, yeah, I ended up being pretty comfortable. Uh, everyone was very nice. Uh, but there was a lot of outtake photos. Hopefully those never get out. I was completely like burying it all in the middle of the desert. I was in the salt flats shooting. And the guy that was like standing there holding the light was telling me, he's like, I'm a really big fan. And I was like, oh my gosh, like I'm just like, I didn't know what to do. Like he's already seen me naked. And it was just probably the most awkward moment I've ever been. I'm like, I wish you would tell me after the shoot when I had a robe on. Honestly, the whole experience was so beautiful and so amazing. There wasn't any awkward moment. We were shooting on this barge and it was outside as you guys seen. And um, the 4th Street Bridge was about 100 yards away from where we were shooting. And the bridge was packed, it was during rush hour. And I didn't realize the bridge was full of cars until like hours, in, hours into the shoot. And like the whole time after the shoot, I'm just praying that no one like took a snapshot from their car and posted on social media somewhere. All right guys, that's a wrap for us here in Hollywood, but make sure you subscribe to our YouTube page below to stay up to date with all our happenings. Hey, what's up? I'm Omar Gonzalez and you're watching The Mighty 1090.